One of the most beautiful phases of spiritual awakening it really is the phase where you're more reliant on yourself where you will find the answers from within every answer that you're seeking you're finding it within everything you'd love to know you'll find within every confusion you feel you tune inwards and see how to find that clarity again and what is your next step and i think this is the most empowering stage in our spiritual awakening it's when we stop leaning on others we stop leaning on external circumstances um you know anything that we think outside of ourselves will give us better answers than our inner guidance <laughs> because in the end that comes from a, a place of not trusting it comes from a place of um feeling like you don't have the answers so it's sort of a place of lack um and in the end we do have all the answers you have all the answers you need from the universe within yourself and we we just have to learn to trust that we have to learn to trust ourselves and you know i'm saying this because i've went through this myself i was looking for answers outside of myself i was looking for answers um desperately outside of myself because i didn't know how to get to that place within i didn't know how to get the answers that i needed but through figuring this out through going inwards what i found is that you don't find answers through thinking or forcing yourself to 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 get the answers out of yourself but it's more so of releasing resistance and i talk a lot about releasing resistance and i think i do because resistance is such a part of our lives i think uh i think in every single person will feel some kind of resistance towards a certain thing and especially when we're looking for guidance we're not really taught to um you know lean on ourselves for that we were taught to always listen to the teacher always listen to something outside of ourselves always listen to the government um, and <laughs> not that that is wrong but i'm just saying you know we're conditioned to think that we need guidance from outside of ourselves whereas in the end it's already in us it's already here and i think that's part of spiritual awakening is realizing that it's realizing that everything is already in us and um you know basically the whole universe is acceptable is accessible through entering our internal state and going through those layers of of our sense of self and so everything is already in you and um you know if you stop looking for answers outside of you you will feel that first you'll have to move through a layer of resistance you'll have to raise your vibration you actually have to feel like you uh t kind of put your mind on a vacation you put your mind on a vacation and you just feel what's going on inside of you if you're feeling some heaviness in your heart start doing things like moving your body doing a meditation um going outside going in nature anything that allows you to be with that feeling but also being able to release that for example breath work is also a great way to do that and whenever we release this resistance we are actually what we're doing is we're um getting rid of this heavy energy that we're carrying with us because often times when we don't find when we don't have clarity or we feel like we really 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 need answers right now this is part of some energy 
blockage. I wouldn't say really blockage because it means it, it, it sounds so dramatic, but it's just an area in your body where energy is not fully flowing uh, freely. And once we allow ourselves to open up that energy again, to release the heaviness, we will feel that this sense of ease and trust and knowing will slowly come back. And this can only happen when we tune inwards and we allow ourselves to move through the discomfort. And the more we're going to look from a place of lack and desperateness outside of ourselves, I feel the more that that is going to amplify in our lives. And um, I just truly wish for you to feel, to have that most empowered life, to feel like you're leaning into, you know, you, your true self. And not, you know, even listening to me is, um, you know, it's great listening to inspirational speeches and getting inspiration from other people and listening to information that resonates with you. But then at the end of the day, you know what is best for you, yourself. You have the power and only you have the power for you because you are the one who is connected with your higher self and your authentic path that you need to walk or yeah, your spirit actually signed up for um, before you came here. So let me know in the comments if there are any aha moments, if there are anything you feel like you're uh, easing into right now, you're releasing resistance and um, you, you're, you found a way to tune into that part that, um, that knows, that always inner knowing that you're safe and that you're exactly where you need to be and intuitively knowing what next step you'd love to take. Let me know in the comments, I'm very curious to know. And thank you so much for liking this video and for sharing this video with anyone who you think could benefit from this message right now. Maybe your family, your friends or your community members. And of course, if you're new here and haven't already subscribed to my channel, remember to do so as you will be the first to watch all of my videos every Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays so that you can create your best life. Remember, we have such an exciting future to look forward to, even if it doesn't seem like it right now. Thank you so much for being here and I'm looking forward to see you in the next video. Bye for now.